Current sources and sinks have many uses in circuits and there are many ways to make them. This slide shows four variations that use a single transistor. Arrangement B will be used to demonstrate the concept. The 10K resistor and two diode drops on the left leg result in approximately 1.2 volts at the transistor base assuming silicon diodes with 6 tenths volt per diode. Since the voltage drop from base to emitter is 6 tenths of a volt, the emitter voltage will be 6 tenths of a volt. Placing a 56 ohm resistor below the emitter to ground results in an approximate current of 11 milliamps through the load, assuming the base current is low enough to be ignored. Here the circuit has been built on a breadboard with LEDs as the load. The bench power supply is set to output 10 volts and the multimeter will display the current in milliamps. We expect to see about 11 milliamps when the power supply is on. Only one LED is in series with the current sink. Note the brightness and that the multimeter is displaying 11 milliamps as expected. The current should continue to remain at about 11 milliamps when the second LED is placed in series. Now, three LEDs. And now, four LEDs in series, each dropping about 1.6 to 1.7 volts. You may have noticed during the demonstration that the current varied somewhat over time. This is at least partially due to the changing load, but also temperature as the transistor and components warmed up. Watch the current as I place my finger on the transistor and then remove it. Thanks for watching and I hope you found it interesting.